Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone around the world. I am Wraith Kind, and today we're going to talk about blacklists on X4 Foundations. So blacklists is very, very important if you don't want to lose all of your ships. Um, there's several blacklists that I have already created. Um, this depends on the type of ship that you want to apply this to. Okay, so let's walk through it shall we let's create a new blacklist um it'll allow you to name the blacklist here um for this case we're not going to change the name but um then you can choose the type of blacklist um, there's trade restrictions sector activities and sector travel okay so sector travel is fairly simple you can set it to apply to all of your military ships or all of your civilian ships or both which can be useful um, if you want your civilian ships to focus on trading and support activity and your military ships of course is going to be focused more on patrol and attack okay so in this circumstance let's say civilian ships okay so you can have some very large um kind of general uh restrictions so you have you can restrict sectors owned by enemies now this will determine on your current um your current factions and relations okay so if you're in the red here uh then you will not travel to sectors owned by those enemies however the issue with that is that oh i lost it here um the issue with that is that some sectors while not technically owned by your enemy uh can barely be controlled by your enemy they might have a couple of defense platforms they might have um regular forays into um what they consider their enemy territory so that may be a good starting place but probably not all you need uh in which case you can restrict travel by factions or by sectors um generally speaking if you select sectors owned by enemies then you do not necessarily have to choose sectors owned by the following factions be unless you want to restrict movement to specific factions for a specific uh you know for your civilian ships for example however one thing that i have found most useful is restricting specific sectors okay so um as most people know the matrix 451 is a xenon sector even though i don't necessarily have to click that because they're the enemy and i'm already restricting um this is just an example okay so if i wanted to restrict travel to just that sector then i could add the sector now for activities it's a little different uh, essentially activities would be patrolling trading whatever right um, you have a lot of the same selections you can do it uh, apply it to civilian ships you can apply it to military ships or both uh, sectors owned by enemies um, and likewise you can add restrictions on sectors or factions trade restrictions now this is a little different okay so trade restrictions will help you um, by allowing you to say well i don't want to restrict travel to these specific places however i do not want to trade to these specific places now the net result is this you will allow travel to for example through uh, the Terran Protectorate but by providing a trade restriction you cannot trade with them so you can travel but not trade and that takes care of our trade rules for global orders I hope that helps happy flying